hey guys welcome back to the channel you know it's rush to discover boss and we're right outside of melrose hill right on the winston jones highway so what we're doing is tracking the highway 2000 the new leg that's been done um, this is from Glenmuir in Maypen where the current highway 2000 finish and it will run to roundabout at Williamsville in Manchester. It's dated to finish October 2022. I don't think they'll meet that deadline. Let me know what you guys think. And it's at a cost of over 4.5 billion Jamaican dollars. So leave your comments. Uh, this is tracking the route of Highway 2000. We did two previous video. So this is the third and, and final video. Just highlighting one the path of the highway and some of the key areas that it will pass and just showing you guys some of the update some of the work being done on the highway 2000 remember to like the video guys remember to comment remember to share the video and remember to subscribe if you're new to the channel as well so we'll show you guys around the area as i'm doing and then i'm going to set up the drone so you guys can see exactly how the area looks from a drone eye view. Um, we'll finish off the video right at the Williamsfield roundabout. Um, so that's where we're going to finish. I mean, we to drive in video right there. But you guys definitely stay tuned for that. So we're going to set up the drone now so you guys can see this area. So the highway will pass over this roadway. This remains currently. It's the Winston Jones Highway that runs into Mandeville and the highway will cross this area so stay tuned guys remember to like comment share um, subscribe if you're new and thanks for the support guys so let's go all right guys so before I send up the drone right here in the Winston Jones highway area the Melrose area we're at the Melrose Yam Park right over here let me zoom in a little bit so Melrose Yam Park. Alright, so the highway will literally run behind this complex and then it will end at the Melrose, sorry, the Williamsfield roundabout. So I'm gonna just drive to that area so you guys can see exactly where the highway will end. So stay tuned for it. We're still on the highway 2000. Um, so we're tracking highway 2000 that's what we're still doing so this is the third video I did, I did two previous videos one down in Maypen one in Clarendon Park and this is now Williamsfield Manchester I'll put the link for the first two videos in the comment section as well so you guys can see and this is the final video before we set up the drone just want to show you guys where the highway that's the Maypen to Williamsfield leg of the highway where it will end. And again guys, thanks for clicking on each video. Thanks for commenting. Thanks for sharing. So I know previous videos I only covered um, the Glenmuir area where we're doing the work and also the Fogar Road area. But this time around we're able to do three videos. You know, just highlighting, just tracking the highway, showing the route of the highway. Um, for you guys, so definitely let me know your com let me know your comments. Let me know what you think. Um, yeah, definitely. This video did take some time, you know, you know, from drone shots to ground shots. So let's see if we can get this video vi as viral as possible, so you know, persons can see some of the great developments that's happening in Jamaica, and persons can see the progress of the highway as well so definitely share the video guys remember to comment if you haven't done so as yet just leave a comment and if you have ever been to the yam park as well um let me know let me know what's your favorite thing over there to buy as well and remember to subscribe subscribing is completely free it doesn't cost you but at least you'll be supporting the channel Thanks for all the support. I know from time to time persons donate to the channel via PayPal. We have our PayPal information in the comments. And even by watching the video, even by watching the ad, even by liking, commenting or sharing, 
we are also supporting the channel as well so again multi billions of dollars being spent on this leg of the highway you know lots of persons thought they wouldn't continue it or believe they wouldn't continue it from the Glenmuir leg and I'm happy that they decided to and right now they're also working on the St. Thomas um, highway as well so very soon you can leave St. Thomas you know fly through Kingston and reaching Mandeville in probably if I'm estimating probably said two hours max one and a half hours probably two hours if we're coming from St. Thomas probably two hours or a little bit more based on the speed and everything and the amount of traffic so this is the Williams Field Roundabout so this is where the highway will connect they haven't started much work out this side I think what they're doing first is you know digging down the hilly areas you know creating the path of the highway as well before they come back to this side all right so just wanted to show you guys this area guys so thanks for watching thanks for liking stay tuned for the drone so a drone shot is coming up next